Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. I hope my voice is coming good and clear and uh, I know I, I, I wanted to say happy uh, Friday and good weekend but as you see uh, last week stabbing in London Bridge today shooting in Pensacola uh, more than 80 people get killed in Iraq six people get in a, a, in, in, a, a, in a church in Africa uh, I mean all of this for sure because of the religion of peace and you know if you question this religion of peace people will say to you you are Islamophobic for sure I mean and look at this president we have look how great he is he is telling us that the king of Saudi Arabia is sorry and not only that not only he is sorry he is saying that he the king of Saudi Arabia agree that this is a barbaric action <laughs> you know sometimes there is a kind of a comedy will make you cry as if the king himself is not barbaric more than the shooter Donald Trump did the king of Saudi Arabia stop ar arresting Christians for praying in their house for having a Bible did he stop slaughtering and beheading a Muslim who converted to Christianity or he became an atheist or even he became uh, whatever I mean look at those uh, you know politics is very dirty and very disgusting so the king of Saudi Arabia is sorry shouldn't you be sorry you are the one who brought them here just for the sake of money you give them visa and not only that you give them arms you see he's not just coming as a tourist no he is coming as a soldier and you give him access to arms inside a military base and actually we are lucky he did not get his his hand in something very heavy duty machine So those leaderships, <clears throat> you see, I voted for uh, uh, Trump, and I will vote for him for again. I mean, because we don't have a better deal, but all of them they are the same. This man Donald Trump, he wanna sell us out that the king of Saudi Arabia is sorry. Was he sorry when he stoned women to death this year? How many women they were stoned to death in in Saudi Arabia this year? How many people their hands is cut off? You see. I'm not surprised. Are you surprised about the attack? No, I'm not. I mean, this is what they do. This is the fruit of Islam. But I'm surprised that in the West, still we have a bunch of liars and they don't want to say the truth that the problem is, is what? It is Islam. Why we don't see a Christian, he go to Saudi Arabia to work, they are shooting people in the street. Or a Hindu. Hmm? Uh, Buddha somebody shooting and say calling Buddha Akbar Buddha Akbar They don't want to say the truth the problem is Islam and The barbaric action of this shooter is way nicer than the barbaric action of your friend the king of Saudi Arabia Because this king he practiced officially stoning to the Butter the year 2009, and you are proud about stabbing him to the heart. And actually, uh, uh, I mean, the, we think that things have changed by Donald Trump, he will be better, but it's the same garbage, garbage in, garbage out. Obama, he went there, nothing happened. It's the same garbage. Uh, Bill Clinton was there, nothing happened. Did you, you know, Trump and the, the, the Congress and the Senate, they just sign. Uh, like a law to protect the Muslim yog the yogur in in China. How come Trump did not talk about the Christian Christian discrimination in China? Suddenly Trump is the one who protects the Muslims in China. You know what? I support protecting any anyone is discriminated. But how come this guy he did not make a law to protect the Christians in China? Why only the Muslims? Only the Muslims? Hypocrite. Hypocrite, you are no different from others. But as you said, we have no choice but to vote for them. All of them, they have one God. It's called money, dollar. Erdogan is slaughtering people.
and yet you call him your friend and you welcome him in the White House he is occupying a Christian villages a Christian towns Kurdish towns and he's slaughtering the people and he changed the demographic of Syria bringing his own terrorists to the borders and kicking all the Christians and the Kurdish from there and yet you welcome him in the White House I'm so proud of you my microphone is not good I'm not sure from my side it's coming fine Anyone have a problem with my microphone? Maybe sometime when I, because I'm upset, you know, I hit the table, so that will shake the cable. Yeah. I know the, you know, the, 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 it's really disgusting to see those people, you know, the, the, they call themselves a president and kings. And now it's time to say, I'm sorry, you know, I'm sorry for what happened. What what you will do to those families who they, they lost their sons and daughters? Well, sorry, what sorry would do to them? You will give them a check. Christmas is coming. A girl, she is 20 years old. Or a boy, he is 21 years old. He should take vacation soon and go to have a Christmas with his mom. You will call his mom and say to her, the king says he's sorry. Or you will give her a check. I mean, the world today have no shame, and all of this for what? Why you are even giving those people training in you in USA? Don't you have already USA army in Saudi Arabia? Let them train them there. Maybe many people do not know that if you are a Saudi, this is for a while, long time. Just because you are a Saudi, when you enter USA, they give you a diplomatic visa. You believe it? Which means you cannot. No shame. Share this with you. It's really disgusting. And the king. Four, three. How many Christians? YouTube issue because here my my uh, download the video. Doing business for for them everything. If one of his children was between. he would be All right, guys, thank you very much. Uh, with, um, 119. Anyway, 